Hi, this is Joe. Welcome to Baseballisms, and this is part two of our um, Ballpark Alusa tour that uh, I took with uh, my buddy Frank Pazanis in the summer of 1987. Um, the previous post was our adventures at uh, Yankee Stadium in New York, and now we're on to the second day, and we went down to Philadelphia, and we got up early that morning in New York and just flew on down the uh, Jersey Turnpike into Philadelphia and uh, we were pulling into town and uh, happened to turn on the radio station and uh, we found out actually that it, it turns out that there was some kind of makeup game or something going on because it was going to be a double header that day uh, at Veterans Stadium and uh, so we were like all excited hey that's great you know we got two games that we were only expecting one that that night um, so we kind of had to scramble a little bit. We, we dumped the car at the hotel that we were staying at and uh, we went running down to the, uh, to the train to, that we were going to take down to Veterans. And uh, as we arrived in the platform station there, we uh, heard the sound that the doors were closing and the train was getting ready to take. And so in our enthusiasm, we just bolted for the train and we just ran in just as the doors were closing and, and right behind us was this woman. Uh, that had seen us running and so followed us onto the train and uh, the train promptly just pulled off into one of those little side bins or whatever it is where they park the trains and so the three of us actually were stranded there on the train uh, looking at each other like what just happened here <laughs> you know and so so she asked us uh, what's going on and we we're like well we don't know and she's like well I followed you guys because you looked like you knew what you were doing um, so we had to wait for a little train conductor dude to come walking down <laughs> and he was kind of startled like what are you guys doing here and uh, we're like well we got on the train we heard the door closing and uh, so he had to kind of walk us out and up and over the ramp and down onto the other side so we could get on the train which is going in the right direction for us uh, to take us down to what turned out to be kind of like a defining moment of our trip. Um, because being young and, and fun guys that we are, um, two games are better than one. And so, uh, since it was a makeup game, it was an afternoon game, we got into Veterans Stadium and started having our beverages there nice and early in the afternoon and uh, pretty much had the, uh, the stadium to ourselves that afternoon because uh, you know, it, was, it was a time when people really hadn't even expected the fact that there was a game. So. Um, Frank and I just kind of wandered around and we were having our fun and uh, ended up sitting down on the right field foul line uh, right by where the ball girl sits in, in Veterans Stadium there. And uh, so we just kind of got to know her a little bit. Her name was Paula. And Paula, if you're out there, then this is us crazy guys from 20 years ago that uh, ended up talking to you down there. Um, but we actually got her to sign an all-star ballot because we had so much fun. She was our celebrity for that, for that day. Um, and so it says, to Frank and Joe, love Paula. And uh, so we were smitten from that moment on. Um, but as I say, we started our beverages early that day. So the downtime between the first and the second game lended itself to have me kind of doze off a little bit <laughs> at, at the ballpark um, while Frank did a little bit of exploring and just kind of wandered around Veterans Stadium in between games and back then it was you know one of those things you didn't have to vacate or anything you just left you there until the next game started um, but so we ended up sitting through two games that night I kind of recovered a little bit in the second game we saw the uh, the Phillies play um, so that afternoon we saw two games um, it was just Frank and I that day. We saw the uh, Phillies and the Pirates play, so that would, this would end up being the uh, first of two times that we saw the Pirates uh, on this particular trip. Uh, as I mentioned in the first post, though, I just couldn't keep score any longer, and uh, so I can't tell you any of the specific details about who was on those teams, what the scores were, uh, or anything like that, but um, Paula was the one that made that trip for us. So after uh, getting out of Veterans Stadium, we were able to make our way back on the train. Uh, and our good fortune had it that uh, there was a nice Irish pub down uh, in the, the street level of the hotel that we were staying at. So Frank and I closed that pub down that night and uh, little did we know that we'd have to pay for it on our next leg of the trip, which was a long drive from Philadelphia all the way out to Cincinnati, Ohio. Part three of our adventure.
part somewhere. <laughs>